Hello and welcome. Uh, I'm starting a new series. Uh, Prison Architect is the game. Um, <clears throat> let's see how she runs. Um, I haven't played this game in a long time, but when I was at PDXCon, I met uh, the guys that made the game, and it reminded me of what an awesome game Prison Architect is. So I'm going to give it a go. Why would I choose brick over concrete? Auto lights. Okay, let's get brick. Let's get nice old-fashioned brick. Um, what do we need to... Oh, wait. There's all kinds of things you have to do. Read the CEO's letter. Okay. Congratulations on completing your basic induction. You are now a fully qualified prison architect. Whew, I don't know about that. Soon you'll be designing, building, and running your own prison, starting from nothing but an empty plot of land and a few stacks of bricks. Before you get started, though, I thought I might share some important lessons with you. Every prison needs a warden. He should be one of your first hires... Build him a nice office and he'll open up a whole range of advanced facilities via the bureaucracy system. Individual jail cells are expensive, so especially early on when funds are tight. Save money by starting with a single large holding cell, which can be shared between many prisoners. Get your kitchen and canteen up and running before the first prisoners show up. And be sure to hire some cooks. Nothing irritates a prisoner with an empty stomach. Building a prison is an expensive undertaking. You need to become a master of raising large volumes of money. Okay, so... Rooms. So you got cell. I'm not. I'm not playing with any mods, by the way. Um, apart from, I think there's just a, one that makes it more clear what their needs are. And I know there's lots of cool mods, and people will suggest them. But I wanted to get the basic game down before I uh, moved on to any mods. So holding cell, five by five, enclosed, surrounded by walls and doors, indoors, toilet, and a bench. What else do we have? Fences, concrete wall. Perimeter wall. Remove tunnels. Wow, tunnels. Okay. I really haven't played this in a while. Alright, so let me see. First things first. Let's get a fence. Don't the guys have to... These are my workers arriving, right? Um, What about doors? Large jail door or a jail door? Can we fit a large jail door in there? Alright, so this, this is like my entrance. Um, my entrance airlock. Fence, okay. Is this expensive? Three dollars per, per square. Yeah, that's not too bad. Um, it looks like it's hot and somewhere in the the Arizona desert or something, something like that. That's what it feels like. Alright, so let's build a nice little, nice little holding cell. Oh, do I do it like this? Okay. Alright, hold on. Um, how do I just cancel it? There we go. Alright, so a nice brick building. Object. So we've got a door in there. Um, what else do we need? The utilities. Oh, we will need a power station. All right. So I kind of want to have a a fenced-off area where I'll put power station, and we'll need to have an area for the kitchen and such. Alright, so let's put another jail door. This is going to be ugly as hell, because I'm, I'm bad at this game, but we'll get there. Yeah, large jail door. Um, fence, 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 fence. Alright, now we need another room. 
Okay, hold on. Room, holding cell. Oh, I need those things first. Alright, so what did it need? It needed uh, indoors, a toilet, and a bench. So where's my bench? There's a bench. Get a couple of benches in there, right? We're gonna have... Jeez, these are expensive. Oh, it's 30 bucks. Alright. We need to remove those... Friggin' trees. Oh, nuts! Oh, come on! Oh, for Christ's sake. Alright, well, Christ, let's just see what happens. Build. Build, my little goblins. They're gonna put the fences down, right? Okay. Go on, lads, to work. Let's speed it up. Away they go. Oh, there's all our materials. Alright, okay, now they're doing it, they're doing it. Oh, we made 35 bucks. Thank you. I figured the fence will stop them running away, right? I mean, that makes sense to me. This will be the power building. And this will be the warden's office. And maybe another office. Now we're making the money. Now we're making the real money. Not throwing it away on shipping costs. Okay, hold on. Utilities. Alright, so we need a little power station. Apparently we have one. A little capacitor. Boop. Electrical cable. Alright, good, good. Um... Does it run from there? And then we need a water pump. Go there. And pipe. We'll pop the toilet right there by the door. And where was that toilet? Bingo. Crapping right by the door. They love that. Sell it. Shit, we're making money just out of the wood here. We're making money from trees. Why don't we just do this? Oh, baby. Hey, we got power. Oh, we need to run power to the... Uh, uh, where was it? Electrical cable. Okay. Oh, you got to connect it on this side. All right. All right, sweet. Oh, we didn't have to do that. Okay. Damn. All right, well, that was a waste of money, but it, it happens. All right, I thought there was a door here. Close that door. Oh, I need guards for that first. Okay, all right, so wait a second here. Um, all right, so we've got room, holding cell. Yeah, and now we need... Uh, um... How do we make an office? Forgotten. Rooms. Alright, yeah. That's a holding cell. What's not right with it? Minimum size 5x5. Five five. One, two, three. Toilet and a bench. How is it not? There are no canteens accessible. Prisoners in this cell will have nobody to eat. Oh, okay. Yeah, fair, fair, fair. Um... Alright, so, foundations. I think the canteen's got to be pretty big, right? Uh, 
Um, objects. Put a large door for the prisoners. And we need a kitchen door as well, right? And... Alright, let's see how that goes. To work! Goblins! Beautiful. Well done, lads. Okay, so... Room. Kitchen. Indoors, you need a cooker, a fridge, and a sink. So where's our cooker? Yeah, there's a cooker. Which way around is that? That. Fridge. Fridge. Hope that's the right way around. Sink. And that is there. That. Um, so we'll need... Water over there in a sec. I feel like we could rock some small pipes at this point. Oh, that uh, damn. Power, power. Run the cable. Run it! How are we doing on the old power? It's not at full capacity, is it? So it's doing okay. Um, let's build a nice... A nice wall. And a door. Separate the kitchen from the lunatics. Um, okay, and then we need a serving table. And where are they going to, what are they going to eat at? All right, so let me see. Rooms. Uh, canteen. That's the canteen. And the kitchen. That's the kitchen. What? Oh, we haven't connected up the... Alright, hold on. Alright, oh, sweet. So that is a kitchen. Needs a table and a bench. Alright, hold on. Table... 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 Okay, table, yeah. We'll get a couple of tables in here. Where's the benches? Bench. There we go. Beautiful. Beautiful. By God, it's a prison. All right, now, hang on. Walls. Brick walls? Oh, wait, rooms. What do we need? Uh... Garbage. Where your waste is collected. Well, that's there, isn't it? Um, deliveries, canteen, visitation, staff room, reception. Oh. Yeah, we could do with a reception room. Um, holding cell. Office? So it has to be four by four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So we could put in... Um, oh, all right. What do you need? What do you need? You need an office desk, a chair, and a filing cabinet. Okay, office desk. This is going to be the warden's office. With a chair, obviously. Filing cabinet. Chair, 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 chair. There we go. 
Why are all the doors open? Do we need a policy? Quick build. Oh wow. Quick build a canteen. Quick build a common room. That's a good idea. Um, so I wanted a reception room. I quite like the idea of having that. Room. Reception. You need indoors with an office desk, a table, and a chair. I mean... If we get eight arriving at once, when they all be in the reception? Not quite sure how that would work. What's, what's this? Garden outdoor area. Why would they garden? I don't understand. We've just left bricks lying around. That doesn't seem like a good idea to just leave bricks lying around the prison. Oh god. Oh my god. We got eight prisoners arriving in an hour and 58. Two minimum security, six normal security. We need some staff, by god. Um, oh, well, let's get a warden. And guards. Let's get... Let's get four. Who closes the damn doors? Did I fuck up somehow? I'm sure I have. Maybe the doors only close when the prisoners turn up? Is that what happens? All right, let's let's quickly let's quickly put in a reception area here. Um we need a nice big old jail door. I want to let them know when they turn up. What the hell? <laughs> it's going to be our reception. Maybe the guards only get going with the whole locking things down thing when the prisoners turn up. We can only hope that that's the case. So the reception needs an office desk, a table, and a chair. So let's just get that office desk. Table. And a chair. Stuff. I guess the guard does it. Yeah. Oh, we need to cook. Oh, whoa, whoa, we got prisoners. All right, now, let's see who we got. Cox. Six years for multiple crimes, including dangerous driving and perjury. No family. Okay. Miller. Doug Fresh. Bullied his entire life after years of being tormented by his roommates, Alex and Bob. Doug snapped and violently killed them both. He stab, he stab, he roommate Alex over 150 times, over a 150 times, and beat Bob to death with a pair of sandals. Blimey. Ian Locke, two years for driving under the influence. Warren Chafer, 23 years. Death by dangerous driving, dangerous driving, and death by dangerous, dri dangerous driving. Holy crap. Mark. Well, let's say Wiener, 13 years for trafficking. Alex White, death by dangerous driving. These guys can't drive. Ryan, the philosopher fellows. 
Convicted of theft after all but one book was found to be missing from a library he frequented nightly. Authorities confirmed suspicions when neighbours reported Ryan building a castle of books in his backyard. Sentenced to six years for carjacking. He has a wife, a daughter, and father. And who's this guy? Duncan Tothill. One year for voyeurism. Dirty boy. 